that's what I ever wrote. Uh, this was a dumb boy, it was blood. You will never be the winner, you will get eaten like microwave dinner. Don't cry, dry your eyes, just like Mike Skinner. Don't watch me, bud, because you're too in it, in it. And yeah, I remember the rest is it's dumb shit like that when you're in school. This one to my G's in the north, G's in the west, and all my G's in the south. Can't forget G's in the east to keep it low key and not speak with police or a bat. Living on a minimum wage, trying to escape, just can't leave it and bats. You can take my night at the ends, but I still know who I am. Am. Do you know what's gonna go off later, yeah? What? I'm gonna make Jack drop it then run, but I'm gonna make him drop it differently, so I'm How? basically. What way? I'm gonna test them and see if they know the bar. Good to the I was thinking, right, like. Was it man can't chat about dubs? You got dubs! Come in and let's do dubs! You can have 22 dubs and make it head spin like say you took 22 dubs. Then this is the point where they'll clock on your socks. Yeah, yeah. Was it? Um, it? You're gonna make dubs. dubs. What are you? Dumb. Can't have none of that stuff. stuff. You got a for a 64 full of gun bars and I'm saying it now, you ain't dumb. You're gassing. Whoa. You got that! You see me not that! I think I remember one day I was at my cousin's house when I was running up the stairs and started freestyling just off the top of the dome and he's heard me and he's like it's my older cousin now he's about what five six years older than me so he's heard me running upstairs started spitting and he's like come here come here I'll say that again say that again da -da -da -da. so I've spat again in front of him and he's gone to me yeah like you're on my crew now so like at the time we had a crew called two deep squad and they used to have a weekly set on um mystic fm so I'm thinking sick crew whatever that means nothing ever came of it but that was what kind of led me to write that first lyric because like my cousin was like oh yeah no you're good like keep going da -da 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 -da. Is your dad coming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Have you done a tune with him yet? Has he played in anything yours? That would be sick. That would be sick. <laughs> you know what? We sick. always talk about it. You got to do it. I spoke about it with my dad and he died. So, like, yeah. you need to go and do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know where I would drop it, but seriously. Yeah. Like, it's it's like, it's like, yeah. You got to do it. To be honest with you, most men that we know that like don't have really great relationships with your, their, their, their parents, you know, yeah. their fathers and stuff. So the fact that you do, and he's a like you know super dope musician, yeah, for real. you know, it's like you know that's the least that you can do. Actually, how did it go for you like when you guys as, my first ever as like Black Tronic or like when you guys had your first, or first even like your own show? I think the first show we did was at Hammersmith Palais. So it was a big show, yeah, massive attack. Show. And I just remember walking out and just being like, whoa. This is a large amount of people and just kind of realising that despite the amount of rehearsals I had I didn't have stagecraft yet, do you know what I mean? So just simple things kind of like, you know, stages here, like, you know, giving your energy to the left, to the right, to the yeah. middle and most importantly to the top, mm. you know, even from the place of the balcony and all of a sudden there's this like, next level of That's people the next whole there. Realm of people that you have to I mean it's mad for me because, you know, I just remember when you were 13 and you were like MCing, you know, to kind of, in the bedroom and like to really small crowds and like, I can really remember being at Run Them one time we were like, okay, so yeah. now's the time that you've got to go up and like, you know, say some things. And I just, I could always remember like, you know, there was a period of time where basically every time you went up, you did the same lyric. <laughs> <laughs> Until you put them like, every yeah. week you have to come with something Yeah, and no, it's just like, you've got to come with something different. But that was kind of, so that's amazing to see someone go from like, I literally, I want to MC, I'm coming out of my bedroom, I've got one lyric, to now I'm like headlining, you know, I feel no, so- I have to thank you for that from the bottom of my heart. Because that taught me so much. Bro, I'm like, so proud of you, man. It's kind of like, is your mum, has your mum coming down to the show? Uh, has she seen you perform yet? She's seen me perform. Yeah. She's definitely seen me perform. So I brought her to Moon Dance Festival <laughs> okay. in Stratford. Nice. And um, it was funny because my tent was actually empty for my whole performance. Because it <laughs> <laughs> well, When you say empty, you mean like how there many was people like were there? five people in the tent. Shit. Probably. You know, my thing is though, the, the best thing I've ever, I ever learnt from shows is when you go and see someone perform to a small crowd, the way they were performing to the a big crowd, yeah, that's when you really realise who are the performers.
small kids move big bits in the ends at broken dress like the rich in the ends. That's been going on since the beginning of time, bro. Like, things like, I don't know, gentrification, that's been going on forever. Things of danger like people fearing people who have too much knowledge of something in any situation, that's been going on forever. Like, as an MC as well, bro. Like, if you're not saying something, that's gonna make people think or make them question something around them. What are you doing? You're basically just here for the bants, bro. Like, you're basically just here for the novelty, of, the novelty of things, innit? And that's not really what I'm about. Ring the alarm, everybody's in danger. If you ain't careful, I'm gonna do a madness. Trust me. Jam, ski. Yeah, Shamsi, we done it again.